Hello, Virgo, this is Starbright. I'm here to do your reading for today, tomorrow, and the weekly reading. Let me see what's going on with you guys. It's not going to resonate with everyone, so please do not get mad if it's not your story. This is going to be for the sun, the moon, rising, Venus, and Jupiter, spirit of the earth, water, fire, and air. Show me cards I need to see. What's going on with Virgo for today? What's going on for tomorrow? And what about the weekly? November the 21st through the 28th. The bottom of the deck? Hmm. Somebody's feeling sad. This is the one that's trying to control their emotions. This is the one who could have cut, cut you out of their life. This person could have ghost you. Could be an Aries or a Taurus. Or somebody's in this energy. This is the one you close on a cycle. Because this person was very controlling and have a big ego. This person do want to speak the truth to you about someone they saw was a missed opportunity. This could be the father of their kids or someone, a Taurus or someone they was committed to. And they do want to apologize to you. All right. For today, we have the page of ones. Somebody want to send you a passionate message or you want to send somebody a passionate, passionate, a passionate message. Hmm. And for tomorrow, someone very obsessed with you. And for the week, someone want to balance things out with you. All right, for today, you got the page of one. Someone want to send you a very passionate message. Oh, the roles can't be reversed. This is someone who's juggling you and someone else. This person want to come in and, and sweep you off your feet or send you some kind of romantic proposal. This is someone who's in a third party. This is someone you could have made at work. This person see you as someone very beautiful or handsome, very abundant. They see you as someone that will be very supportive. This person see you as they wish. Hmm, this person can be very arrogant and have a big ego. The roles can be reversed. This is someone who could have ghost you. This is someone that see you as someone very powerful. The person can live across the water. This is someone that you had closed out a cycle with this person. That person want to move forward with you. This person could be married or you can be married. This person want a reunion with you. This person want a serious relationship with you. All right. For tomorrow, some of you guys might be dealing with a Capricorn or someone is very obsessed with you. Or someone is toxic. Let's see what's going on with this. That person want to, a Capricorn want to speak the truth to you or somebody that's in this energy. This person see you as a missed opportunity. This person want to pour all their emotions out to you. This is someone that you had a drama or some kind of conflict with this person. This is someone from your past or this is someone you got kids with this person. It could be an Aquarius. This is someone could be very uh, deceitful. Some of you guys are dealing with a Scorpio. An Aries. A Cancer. This is someone that had your relationship on hold. Because of someone they saw was very grounded and like nice things around them. This is someone they wanted to take things to the next level with this person because they were still holding on to this person. This is the one that had to end in with this person, but they really didn't trust this person. Because this person was very flirty and a person liked to be seen. This is someone they took this leap to faith with this person, but that person had broke their heart. Hmm. So for the week, you got the justice here. Somebody want to balance things out with you. It could be a Libra. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. If somebody's in this energy. This person or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Gemini want to balance things out with you. This person want to send you a message that you're going to like. This person trying to make a very difficult decision about you. This is the one that was very indecisive about you. It could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Libra. This person's feeling sad about you. This person trying to control their emotions. This is the one who could have cut you out of their life and let you go. Because of someone, they was thinking about the good times they had with this other person. This is someone they fought for the relationship with this person. But that person stressed them out. That person had them all in their head and couldn't sleep. Because they saw this person as someone who met that financial goal in life. This is who they was hiding from you. Some of you guys are dealing with Pisces. This is someone that's feeling very remorseful because they wanted victory. With someone, they definitely want to apologize to you about this. This person's feeling sad. This person's trying to manifest you back into their life. This is someone who could have walked away from you. The person see this ten of pentacles with you. The happy family, happy life, not worried about nothing. 
A person definitely feeling the repercussions of their actions because of someone they had planted their seed with this person. <laughs> this is someone they was lying to you about. This is the person they was hiding things, hiding this person from you. A, a commitment. <laughs> they saw this person as their sunshine, but that person left them out in the cold. Okay. Spirit, will this person admit they're wrong to Virgo? Show me cause I need to see. Yes. That person gonna admit they're wrong to you because they do want a commitment with you. It's taking this person a long period of time, but this person is coming. Some of you guys can deal with a Virgo or Leo. This person wants a passionate new beginning with you. Some of you guys are gonna be dealing with a Virgo and Leo that's brand new. I see new love here too. That person gonna want a commitment with you. Mm, this person could be married or uh, committed to someone. <laughs> or this person wants to commit to you. This person will live at a distance. And this is someone who want to talk to you. That person want to take action. Or oh, this is the one you had a towel with this person. That person do see you as their twin flame. And they do see you as their soulmate. That person want things to change between you two. This is someone that took a break from you. This is someone that definitely want to move to come and warn us with you. This person trying to make a decision about you. Some of you guys are dealing with Aries. This person is feeling betrayed by someone. They had started a new, uh, a steady, a loving relationship with someone. And they're trying to be patient. Some of you guys are dealing with Leo. This person was a player. <laughs> this is someone they saw a loving, happy family with this person. This is someone they poured all their emotions out to this person, but that person had burdened them. <laughs> this is someone they made a decision on work on things with this person. This is why they was holding back from you. So some of you guys got a blast from the past is coming back, and I do see new love coming in for you guys too. All right. If you need a personal reading for me, all the information is down below in the description box. Some of you guys will deal with Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Until next time, bye-bye.